This is Movie Talk. Leslie Mitchell reporting. People all over the world, in every country, of every faith, join in mourning the untimely death of Pope John. He was universally respected and loved above all things for his humanity. Born of a humble peasant family, he rose to become Patriarch of Venice as Cardinal Angelo Giuseppe Roncalli. He was elected and crowned Pope in 1958, the first Pope to bear the name John for 600 years. At his coronation, he was 76 years of age. His many informal trips outside the Vatican underlined his reputation as the most accessible Pope of modern times. His humility and direct approach made ordinary people feel that he was their personal friend. The highlight of his brief reign was the convening of the Ecumenical Council, the first for nearly a hundred years. It was also the first to be attended by representatives of other faiths. Largely due to his personal influence and efforts, this council has made the cause of Christian unity not only a possibility, but an accepted goal. Pope John thought the papal encyclical Pacem in Terris, Peace on Earth, which he signed in April, the most significant achievement of his reign. It was typical of him that it should be addressed to all men of goodwill and not only the Catholic faithful. He was everywhere acclaimed for the breadth of vision which he brought to the great issues of our time. Hopes of world peace are the poorer for his passing. Pope John started great things, but sadly has not lived to see them come to fulfillment.